Hey guys. So in my last video, I explained a bit about how the about how this computer works. Um, so in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how um, multiplication and division work. So um, I've added a few things since my last video. I've added these labels uh, to make it more uh, kind of user friendly. I've added this automatic timer circuit. So now to input pulses, I don't have to just keep clicking this button. I can it'll do it automatically. Um, I've also added more to the multiplication function part of the computer. So now it can multiply up to 15 times 15. Um, I've added an automatic stopper. So when uh, when a multiplication or addition function has ended, it will automatically stop. And you can tell because this light will turn on. And I've also added more to the accumulator. So now instead of only being able to count up to 127, it can count up to 255. So the first thing we do within the uh, to multiply is we set up the two, which uh, it could be different on other computers. But so this sets it as the multiplication function, and then it, say if we want to multiply twelve, we'll set that in the um, in here. So we want the four and the eight to be on because four plus eight will be twelve. So um, count down to twelve. And so now four plus eight is twelve. Um, and then we turn uh, for thir so Let's say thirteen. We'll set up the f eight and the two and the one. So eight plus, I mean, sorry, the four. So eight plus four is plus one is thirteen. Uh, so then we can set this automatic timer, and what this so this acts as a countdown timer, and so it'll add uh, thirteen to the accumulator uh, 12 times. So now we can speed this up a little bit. Got it programmed into there. And now as you can see that light is turned on and these are reset. So the multiplication function is done. So um, you might not be able to tell very well because of the glare, but um, so 12 times 13 would be 156. So let's see, 128 plus, uh, and this is 16, is 144, plus 8 is um, 152, plus 4 is 156. So that's correct. Um, so now, to do addition, what you do is you count up to the n first number that you want to uh, add within the accumulator, and then what you do is you multiply the other number you want to add to that number within the within the uh, multiplication function of the computer. So you multiply, say, 6 by 1, which will, of course, be 6, and you would add that, and it would automatically add to whichever number is in the accumulator. Now, I'll just have to set these down, and it's all reset and ready to go for a different problem. Um, so that's about it, and in my next video, I'll demonstrate uh, division and subtraction.